What's good, people? It's your boy, Matrix Sound Lab. Uh, just wanted to give a brief example of some of the mappings that I put together. I finally uh, made myself hunker down over the course of the last couple of days and, and create some mappings. I had blessed a friend with uh, my machine, MK1. So in order for me to continue to use a machine controller with Tractor, I had to relearn some of the mapping things and uh i just wanted to give you all a uh, little insight on what i came up with so right now i'm using a, a tractor control s2 and i have two f1 controllers um but in order to access all eight cue points or at least eight cue points on each deck what i got set up here is this is uh this top set the red that's for deck A. The bottom is for deck B, so. So this way I can get to all eight cue points and actually, once I load a, a track on, on at least deck A or B, at that point, depending on what I'm do, what I'm doing, I'll switch over to machine and and control the track from there, unless I'm doing certain effects. Now, as you know, on the S2, you know, once I click this button here, that'll automatically put me on this. Oops, that'll put me on this set of effects here. This A bank. If I hit two it'll put me on that set but you know in uh in the software you have four so what i did over here was on machine this right here is for deck a deck b deck c and deck d so once i hit this i'm sending deck a to effect group a Effect group B, C, and D. And right now, I got, I have deck A going to all four of those. Same thing for deck B. And I have my, I have decks C and D set up as remix decks, but uh, it's the same thing set up for all four of them. Now, what I did on this third set, and and what you may not know is on machine, each one of these blue buttons, the MIDI notes work their way up. So, on my A group, I have my cue points. B, I have my effect sends. Three is where I'm dealing with a uh, freeze mode, and I'll give you an example of that in a minute. And then on four, it gives me a chance to dig a little deeper into effects deep in four, on, on effects three and four, I'm sorry. Because in effect group three, I only have one effect, which is the gator. And on four, I have the ramp D with the individual settings. And those individual settings, like on a ramp D, I have filter, duration, and rate. I sent those over to Machine Studio. Then if I go up here to the gator, you have noise, shape, and rate. And on the left screen, on the machine controller, I have my dry, wet, noise, shape, and rate. So I just transferred those settings over to machine. Then this way, that first set, the knobs are built into the controller. The light's not bright enough in here for you to see it. Let me turn this light on. I don't know if you can see the knobs. Bear with me. Yeah, so see? You have your dry, wet, and your three parameters. Same thing over here, dry, wet, three parameters for effect three, dry, wet, three parameters. And I also made the colors on screen match that, so I know what I'm working with. Now, if we get over here into freeze mode, so I'll play a track as an example. So happy I can Turn on the effect. So 
So you get the idea. I know I wasn't very clear and concise and trying to explain what I did. I'm assuming that you have a little knowledge of, uh, of Tractor itself, the software, and some of the controls, um, and some of the functions. I just wanted to mess with the mappings. Um, I still have some minor league tweaking to do on this set with the freeze mode because, unfortunately, I set it to respond to deck A. So I have to, I may make another set strictly for deck B. We'll see whether or not I have the energy to do that. Um, either way, I hope you dig it. And if you want these mappings, if you happen to use Machine Studio with Tractor, um, let me know. I'll send you these. And you can tweak them yourself to your liking. Oh, one last thing. The other thing I did, just to give me some visual feedback, um, is this row of buttons here. I actually uh, mapped the lights to flash with the music. I did the same thing on my uh, on my F1 too. This actually just gives me the tempo. This is more like a meter, so I'll give you a quick example of that. So these right to where deck B is playing, they go to tempo. And these on the left, they are for deck A. So as you can see, and these are for deck B. That's it. I forgot to throw that in. So that's it. I get up. Peace.